Once upon a time, in the vast savanna of there lived two kings, King Lion and King Mouse. King Lion was known far and wide for his strength, courage, and majestic appearance. He ruled over all the animals in the land with power and authority. On the other hand, King Mouse was a tiny creature, barely noticeable amidst the tall grass, but he was wise, kind, and beloved by all the animals, big and small. One day, a severe drought struck the savanna, and the once lush greenery turned into a barren desert. The animals suffered greatly, as there was no water or food to be found. King Lion, in his pride, refused to acknowledge the struggles of his subjects, believing that he could withstand the drought with his strength alone. Meanwhile, King Mouse, though small, had a big heart and cared deeply for his fellow creatures. He scurried tirelessly, gathering whatever little food he could find and sharing it selflessly with those in need. The other animals admired his kindness and began to look up to him as a true leader. As the drought persisted, King Lion's pride turned into desperation. His strength waned, and he grew weaker by the day. Unable to hunt or find water, he finally realized his mistake in underestimating the severity of the situation. Feeling ashamed of his arrogance, King Lion humbled himself and sought help from the other animals. Seeing King Lion's humility, King Mouse approached him with compassion. Despite their differences in size and strength, King Mouse offered his assistance without hesitation. Together, they devised a plan to dig deep into the dry earth, searching for underground water sources. With King Lion's strength and King Mouse's ingenuity, they eventually discovered a hidden oasis beneath the surface. The water flowed freely, quenching the thirst of all the animals and bringing life back to the savanna. The animals rejoiced, grateful for the newfound harmony between their two kings. Despite their differences in size and power, King Lion and King Mouse were the best of friends. They shared a bond that went beyond their titles and kingdoms. One day, as they were strolling through the jungle, they heard distressed cries coming from a nearby bush. Rushing to investigate, they found a family of rabbits trapped under a fallen tree. The rabbits explained that the tree had been knocked over by a powerful storm, and they were unable to free themselves. King Lion attempted to lift the tree with all his might, but it was too heavy even for him. Seeing his friends struggle, King Mouse had an idea. He scurried around the tree, gnawing at the roots with his sharp teeth. Soon, with the combined efforts of King Lion's strength and King Mouse's agility, the tree was lifted and the rabbits were free. Grateful for their rescue, the rabbits invited King Lion and King Mouse to their burrow for a feast. As they feasted on juicy carrots and crisp lettuce, King Lion remarked, Truly, it is not the size or strength that matters, but the willingness to help others in need. From that day on, King Lion and King Mouse continued to rule their kingdoms with kindness and compassion, always ready to lend a helping paw or a guiding claw to those in need. I in the depths of the lush forest, hidden beneath the thick canopy of trees, ruled King Mouse, small yet clever, his fur blending perfectly with the dappled sunlight filtering through the leaves. Though his kingdom was tiny compared to King Lion's, it was no less important, for it was filled with countless wonders and secrets. Despite their differences in size and domain, King Lion and King Mouse were the best of friends. They would often meet at the edge of the savanna and the forest to share stories and adventures. One day, as they were lounging by a sparkling stream, they heard distressed cries coming from the other side. Rushing to investigate, they found a group of animals gathered around a deep pit, from which echoed the desperate calls of a trapped elephant calf. King Lion attempted to leap across the pit to rescue the calf, but it was too wide even for his powerful legs. Seeing his friend's plight, King Mouse darted forward with a plan. 
Wait here, my friend, he exclaimed. I have an idea. With swift movements, King Mouse scurried up a nearby tree and gnawed at a sturdy vine. With great determination, he pulled and tugged until the vine snapped free. Bringing the vine to King Lion, King Mouse instructed him to tie one end around his waist and the other around the sturdy tree. With King Lion's immense strength and King Mouse's ingenuity, they formed a makeshift bridge across the pit. Together, they carefully made their way across the vine bridge, reaching the stranded elephant calf just in time. With King Lion's mighty roar and King Mouse's nimble maneuvers, they lifted the calf to safety and reunited it with its mother, King Mouse, small yet clever, held court in the intricate network of tunnels beneath the forest floor. Though their kingdoms lay miles apart, King Lion and King Mouse shared a bond of friendship that transcended their differences in size and domain. They often met at the edge of the savanna and the forest to exchange stories and laughter, their friendship growing stronger with each passing day. One bright morning, as King Lion was taking his leisurely stroll through the savanna, he heard a faint cry for help. Following the sound, he discovered a group of animals gathered around a deep pit. Peering into the darkness, King Lion spotted a young gazelle struggling to free herself from the muddy depths. Determined to help, King Lion attempted to leap across the pit. But alas, it was too wide, and he fell short of reaching the gazelle. Just as he was about to try again, King Mouse emerged from the shadows of the nearby bushes. Wait, my friend, exclaimed King Mouse. I have an idea. With a twinkle in his eye, King Mouse scurried off, disappearing into the underbrush. Moments later, he returned with a long vine trailing behind him. With his tiny teeth, he gnawed away at the vine until it was free from the tree. Together, King Lion and King Mouse fashioned a makeshift rope bridge across the pit. With King Lion's strength and King Mouse's agility, they managed to reach the stranded gazelle and pull her to safety. Grateful and relieved, the gazelle thanked her rescuers before bounding off into the distance. As King Lion and King Mouse watched her go, they shared a smile, their friendship stronger than ever. From that day on, King Lion and King Mouse continued to embark on countless adventures together, proving that true friendship knows no bounds. Whether traversing the open plains or exploring the depths of the forest, they stood by each other's side, ready to face any challenge that came their way. And as the sun set over the African savanna, casting a golden glow upon the land, the tale of King Lion and King Mouse's friendship echoed through the trees, inspiring animals far and wide to cherish the bonds they shared with one another.